Despite limited budget, ISAC said stakeholders' involvement has allowed for collective participation in the social and economic rebuilding of the region. In her State of the Region address, she highlighted a number of projects, including the establishment of a vocational training institution to fast-track development. My office is consistently in consultation with the Minister of Higher Education, Training and Innovation, as well as the Namibian Training Authority, for the establishment of a vocational training center in the region. Vocational institutions are the critical vehicles towards industrialization. The region is also in the process of phasing out the bucket toilet system. Nine million dollars has so far been spent to build toilet units in the region's settlements. Wakana settlement, Clay Oak settlement, Maldeir village, Khan village, Hibion village benefited from this project in the region. Nine million Namibian dollars was committed at an estimate cost of 30,201 Namibian dollars, 34 per unit. The toilet units include shower and a wash basin. 298 units are under construction and 118 temporary jobs were created for unskilled local people. The government also called on regional and local leaders in the region to always engage their communities on development issues. 